Welcome, my peeps, my peoples. Please like, comment, subscribe, share the video. It'll be greatly appreciated from the bottom of my heart. My peeps, my peoples. Peep squad is in a building, baby. We're going to the top. We're going to bring others with us. So please become a part of notification squad, baby. Hit that notification bell, baby. You know each and every time I drop a video. So let's get into it. Let's talk about the situation with Married to Medicine. Allegedly, the rumors and the stories out here from media takeout, and I really don't report any stories from media takeout because you know they're not that reliable but some people think they are but it is what it is and media takeout dropped the story that three members of married to medicine were going to be dropped dropped and dropped off from the cast and i was like for real for real and allegedly the three cast members is Dr. Contessa because they feel like her storyline was not authentic at all and it was make-believe and they just really tired of Dr. Contessa. And people were saying that Dr. Contessa, she picked the wrong side. She should have picked Mariah's side. She should have picked Dr. Simone. She should have picked Toya's side because they are the remaining cast. They are still going to be lit and still in the building. So... Take that with a grain of salt. And allegedly, also, Buffy is not going to be a part of the new season of Married to Medicine because she wasn't a good fit. Even though she had a good storyline and she went at the head honcho, Dr. Jackie, people just really felt like she wasn't a good fit and she was too emotional. But she was having, she was crying about her miscarriages and the information being brought up on national TV. And she didn't want the people to know yet. She wanted to tell her own story. She didn't want somebody else to tell her story, which would be Dr. Jackie. You know, it's not that she can't get pregnant. She can actually get pregnant, but she cannot give birth because she ended up having miscarriages. So therefore, she wanted to be the person to tell her story. And also, she has had multiple miscarriages. So talking about the situation brought her to a dark place because she had so many problems with actually carrying and holding on to the baby in her womb that her husband did not want to try again so therefore bringing it up on the show it really was a slap in the face to her and she had an emotional breakdown some people believe her story and some people don't um it's going to be what it's going to be with that situation. I'm not going to think that she's going to make up a story. And she's going to cry like that because she just wanted TV time. I don't think she need the money that much. But yes, everybody wants fame. Not everybody, but some people do. And, you know, it could be a possibility. But also the emotional effects of what she went through when she had her miscarriages could have brought her to that point where she broke down and she cried and it was really emotional for her because that was something deep and something real to her but some people don't believe it and feel like she is not a fit for the show and media takeout saying it's, it's the producers so you guys tell me what you think about the situation and they're also saying that dr jackie is not going to be coming back either that she got the ex too as well what do you guys think about the situation i thought dr jackie was like a staple on the show without dr jackie it's like damn it's like taking mariah i was like taking toya out it's like taking dr simone out whether you like dr jackie or not you know she's always a part of the cast like you want to see her there you want to see her sly remarks you want to see how she turns her nose up at everybody you want to see that situation but the production and the producers are saying that she is not a good fit for the show anyway. And, you know, maybe she is walking away from the show or maybe she did get fired. It's alleged. It's not something that is set in stone. But Dr. Jackie did say in the reunion that she would leave the reunion, especially if she, had, she would leave the show if she has to pick between Dr. Heavenly and Dr. Simone. Like she said, the show doesn't mean that much to me. And she was willing to step down from the show too as well to make sure she has her insanity. So did she get fired or did she walk away? Or is she going to be back on the show? You guys tell me what you think about the situation. But Buffy had something to say, baby. Buffy got onto Twitter and Instagram and basically, she posted herself in a doctor's jacket with her name on it. And she put hashtag Wednesday morning married to medicine. Basically alluding that she did not get fired from married to medicine. And she might possibly well be on the next season of married to medicine. And she's 
possibly debunking the story from media takeout. So what do you guys think about the situation? Mm, mm, mm. And then on top of that, Dr. Heavenly was asked, was it true Dr. Jackie is leaving the show, Dr. Contessa and Buffy? And Dr. Heavenly said, no, it's not true. And Dr. Heavenly is not the first person to debunk a story on media takeout, even a lot of celebrities have debunked stories on media takeout and say that it was all lies. So what do you guys think about this situation? I was like, mm, it seems like, you know, Dr. Heavenly and Buffy are coming out to debunk the rumors and say, it ain't true, baby. It ain't true. Don't believe it. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you got to fake it until you make it. It is what it is. I was like, okay. And moving on from that situation, Toya questioned whether Dr. Heavenly knew what was going on. She was like, I hope you're not made out of a liar to be a liar, Dr. Heavenly. Seems like you have the inside scoop. Give us the tea, girl. And so it seems like Toya was like, girl, you got the information. How would you know? How can you confidently say on Twitter that it's not true? <laughs> because she is close to Dr. Jackie. That could be the situation that she has spoke with Dr. Jackie. And she knows that Dr. Jackie is not fired or possibly she's defending her friend, Dr. Jackie, and trying to debunk the rumors too as well. But Toya is calling out like, hey, you got the inside scoop? Let me know if you got the inside scoop. I was like, okay. So what do you guys think about this situation? Who do you think should go and who should stay? A lot of people are saying that they feel like Quad's ex, Dr. Gregory and his new girlfriend, should appear on the show and become a part of the cast. Because Quad is single and she's on Married to Medicine. They feel like Dr. Gregory was a part of the cast. And she should be on there with his girlfriend. So what do you guys think about that situation? I was like, "Woo, Lord have mercy. That is a whole lot of information going on. What do you guys think? And do you think Contessa should be fired? Do you think Dr. Jackie should be fired? Do you think... Buffy should be fired. Who are you rooting for to come back to Married to Medicine? And what are you looking for new? Yes, we need some new blood. We need some new meat and some new storylines too as well. Let's get it all out in the open. And people are also saying that Mariah's sister Lake should be on the show. And it's allegedly that the rumor that's out now is that the reason why Lake is forgiving of Quads and she wants to have a conversation with Quad because Quad and Lake allegedly had a threesome with Lake's husband. And I don't know if that's true. That's allegedly, that's a rumor. I don't know what's going on with that situation. But we all know that Lake left her husband because he was in jail, baby, from doing some crimes out here and these streets. But they are debunking the stories from media takeout. And that would be Dr. Heavenly and none other than our girl <laughs> Buffy because a lot of people do like Buffy a lot of people feel like Buffy is a good fit for the show so you guys tell me what you think I think they need to just bring more heat to the show they need to do more activities together and tell each other how each how they feel about one another and see if Contessa can actually have a change of heart instead of choosing sides be a part of the whole cast because once you put pick a team you are sheltered into a box and therefore you're not able to film with everybody and get more chemistry and more of a storyline out of the situation too as well but Contessa has been Contessa has been accepted to the college that she wants to attend so you guys please like comment subscribe and share the video it'll be greatly appreciated peace